Okay, so the other thing about my weightlifting class that has helped a lot since the last time I took it was um, the first time I took it, I did endurance training, which is like 15 reps or repetitions, which is like 15, 1, 2, 3, you know, like times of doing the exercise, um, which means you need a kind of a low weight and you do it 15 to 20 times, you rest for a little while, do it 15 to 20 times again, rest a little while, and do it again. So that's three sets of 15 reps. And that's a relatively low weight. Um, and the endurance training is supposed to give you like long, lean muscles. That's like the idea of it. But um, I didn't really get any results from that class. And um, it didn't seem to do much, although it is important to, to do endurance training eventually. But it is also important to step it up and do, um, excuse me if I'm saying it wrong, <laughs> hypertrophy, which is, um, it's 8 to 10 reps of a much higher weight, you do three sets of that. So that means um, you're lifting a higher weight. So your your eighth rep, you you could just barely do it, you know, and and um, that helps to build muscle. And the reason I started out with endurance was because I was like, oh, I'm a girl. I don't really want muscles. I just want to be toned, which is the idea behind the endurance training. Um, but the thing is. Girls don't have much testosterone, and so no matter how hard, well, I can't say that. You can work pretty hard. You can you can exercise and lift weights pretty hard, um, high weights, low repetitions, and still not get gross, bulky bodybuilder. Like we're just not built to get bulky. So the only way to get bulky is if you do like one to two reps of extremely high weight. So you can only lift it once or twice. Um, and that's how you body train or body build if you want. But the hypertrophy, um, eight to 10 reps of a medium weight is, um, is actually really good in it. It got me the results that I wanted from weight training um, as opposed to endurance. However, recently I have realized that I need to kind of switch it up a little bit and do endurance for a little while because my endurance isn't very good. Um, also, I plan to do strength training, which is uh, three to five reps of a higher weight than hy hypertrophy, but a lower weight than... Um, what is it called? Power lifting, which is the maximum one or maximum two. I don't know. I might be say, like spouting out these numbers way too fast. But the main thing is I have learned that keeping my repetitions under 10 um, and doing three sets of those, working every muscle that I can, um, and doing a lot of things on balance balls, um, bosa balls, a lot of balancing kind of things to also work my core at the same time has given, that has all gone towards giving me way better results, way more confidence. I feel really healthy and energetic and um, self-confident and for the most part, I've gotten a lot better at just eating, <laughs> if you know what I mean. Um, Guilt-free, kind of, like, I exercise today, and I have muscle mass now anyway, so I need more calories, so I'm going to eat, and then I do, and then I don't freak out, and it's it's been really good. So, protein and 
something a little more difficult than endurance weight training, um, which for me has been hypertrophy, has helped a lot. So I hope some of you start your own uh, weight training programs and uh, share, share your happiness with your results because it's, it's really good, and I think it will help a lot of you who are looking to uh, eat more normally, again, whatever that means, and, um, and not feel bad about yourself. So um, please share with me if you do take that up. Thanks.